I'm not at all offended that none of you have any idea who I am. It's time to elect John Kerry. I accept your nomination. I accept this nomination. It's a position he's been in many times before. Once again, President Joe Biden will speak at the Democratic National Convention Monday night. He's expected to make a forceful argument in support of his vice president, Kamala Harris. After a whirlwind month in which he made the unprecedented decision to drop out of the race to pass the torch to Harris. Over the weekend, Harris joined her running mate, Minnesota Governor Tim Walz, as they rolled through the key swing state of Pennsylvania on a bus tour, trying to present a contrast with former President Donald Trump. She's bringing out the kindness that ties us together, the decency. Anybody who's about beating down other people is a coward. On the convention floor, DNC Chairman Jamie Harrison told Spectrum's Taylor Popolars that Biden's decision to bow out has dramatically altered the race. And there's a lot of, of new energy because I think the, the vice president has brought some more people into the party mix. Again, she's a different per person than Joe Biden. Longtime Biden surrogate and Maryland Governor Wes Moore said this convention is about consolidating behind Harris. I think the tone that we're going to set is one of joy and unity. The Trump campaign is planning some counter-programming, holding events in swing states all week, starting with a pair of campaign events in Pennsylvania on Monday. Thank you for watching our YouTube channel. Let Spectrum News be your resource for balanced, in-depth political coverage, and click the subscribe button right here. You can also download our app or watch us on TV to learn more about the candidates, where they stand on the issues, and more. We'll see you then.